So let's learn how to create point groups. So when you import points into Civil 3D, Civil 3D creates a default point group called the All Points. Here at the Prospector, you can see the All Points point group under the Point Group branch. If I expand that branch, you can see the All Points point group. So we can also create point groups of our own and leverage those point groups to control the styles and the labels. So how to create a point group is you left click, left click on the point group and uh, right click and go to new. Here you can create a point group of choice. Let me call this topo data. And uh, I want to include the EG points. So the various criteria of uh, including uh, the points you want into a point group here you can uh, select with numbers matching, you can select with elevations matching, with names matching, with row descriptions matching, with full descriptions matching. Um, let me select with row descriptions matching. I will select the EG and then put an asterisk next to it. So remember this is not case sensitive. So whether the points have a description which has a eg in capital letters will not matter so let me apply and go to the points list as you can see at the points list the eg points have been selected for this point group and we can even change the style if you want to and now we can also add on the point label style we can add the point number have the elevation and description or we can just uh, decide to have the point number and the description let's see let me apply and click on ok you will notice that under the point groups branch you will see we now have a topo data branch and we now have an all points branch okay So I will create another point group by going back to the prospector, clicking on point groups, right click and I go to new. I want to create a point uh, that has no display, a point group that does not have display, I mean. So I go to include and I include all points and here at the information tab, at the point style, I select none. And at the label style, I also select none and I apply and I click on OK. As you will uh, observe in, in the drawing window, all the points disappear. So we will see why that happened. So I will click on the point groups, right click and I go to properties. Notice the hierarchy of this point will control their visibility. So if I pick the top of data point group and I take it all the way up and apply click OK and uh, let me zoom extends as you will see now you can see the the top of data point group the top of data point group we assigned it point number and um, and description uh, labels so 